Hello, my name is Jemmy, and today I am going to be giving you a brief overview on how to upload your files into GitHub or how to push it into GitHub. So um, it's pretty simple and easy to do if you know how to do it and follow the steps. So first of all, what you want to do is go to github.com. If you don't have an account, I recommend you to sign up. Um, if you don't have an account, it will go somewhere over here and it says sign up or login. Click sign up, then just enter your um, email and then your username, your password, and then you're set. So once you're done that or you logged in, then click on your profile over here. Click on your repositories. Then after that, um, you can click new on uh, the green icon in your repositories. Click new and then just set your repository name. I'll set this as uh, how to push files into git hub like so hit git hip okay github okay so like this and now I have a file name you can set it to whatever you want I guess the shorter the better so I'm just gonna say push git push github okay push github something easy to remember and then after that you could set it to public or private but I'm setting it to private right now and um, click create repositories like so and then just leave it first I recommend you just um, open half your screen first so if you don't have it go uh, open half your screen either like so and then just shape it to be half or you can install a dualess uh, over here and then just tap on that then choose 5 by 5 if you have dualess then great so and then oh, what dualist does is it automatically opens half your screen um where is it here and then half like that and then i think the other half needs to be a google tab but we can fix that problem by just shutting it down then after this go into your files okay and then um go into your files and then the file that you want to upload mine's all my images are or your like uh, images, PDFs, whatever, and put them. Uh, you can put them inside the file, or you can put them inside a subfolder inside the file. It's quite complicated, but my folder is called test, right? And I have all my images inside a folder called images. You could do that, or you could have all your images outside in the folder test, okay? But right now I have it in images so that it wouldn't get messy. Okay, let's go back. So what we want to do now is we want to click right inside our folder, but if you have it inside a subfolder, then just, okay, basically simply, <laughs> okay, gosh, go inside your main folder, okay? So look, right now I have test, and inside test I have images where I store all my photos, right? Instead of going inside images, we're going to stay outside of it. And we're gonna click right and click git bash here. If you don't have GitHub, the link um, to download Git, no, not GitHub, sorry, Git is down below. Just click install for Windows, Mac, um, or whatever you're using, and then install. Then, once you have it installed, uh, you can pause this video, then click right, and click Git Bash here. Okay, now you should have a Git a Bash uh, folder popping up. You can just, uh, you can make, uh, you can shut down, not shut down, but like, yeah, there you can close your file now for now which oh there's I just looked out my window there's a really beautiful flock of sparrows um well I forgot to do git in it like this do that first which makes it I guess connected to git and then it, it can access um, git command so after that what we want to do is we want to do the code that we were trying to do which was git remote um, add origin origin like so and then copy your um post thingy again and then paste paste it uh like so then click enter and there we go now the error shouldn't appear um like so then after the second after the second command the third command would be uh remote and then dash v and then it would should pop up your uh 
github uh, page thingy over here uh, and then after that what we want is we want to do git add and dot now this might take a couple of minutes pretend um, this is basically adding all your files up into git or like your program right now um, it might take a while if you have a lot of images but if you don't then it would probably take no time like mine's I only have like seven or eight images I think but if you're uploading a lot then just be patient and wait okay if it's like um, if it's not popping up then just be patient and wait until it's done okay um, let, you can pause this video if it's not done yet however if it is done then let's continue so um, moving on we're going to have a git commit dash m and then this uh, right here we're going to put in the name that we have right here so whatever your repository name is put it right here mine just push github so I'm gonna push github um, I'm pretty sure it's sen uh, case sensitive so make sure you get your ca uh, capital letters correct and then click enter okay perfect now if it appears something like mine sort of uh, where it shows your file names then you are good you are set to go now after you're done with this what we want to do is we want to enter our um, gmail or email and our uh, username for github so i will just show you how to do it but i will um after i'm done i will use the command clear like so and then it should clear out and it shouldn't show my um gmail but i will show you the format and the template of how where and how to put your gmail so here is git right git config follow me okay dash dash global global and then user dot email like so and after that what we want to do is we want to put in your gmail in these brackets so whatever your gmail is uh, let me just put example at gmail or anything that you use honestly um, at gmail dot com like so and then use your um, gmail for this not example at gmail dot com but yeah, just use your Gmail, and after I'm done putting in my Gmail, I will clear out the code so you, um, it would be like it's nothing. But yeah, so uh, go enter your Gmail, click enter, and wait for me. So on my page right now, you there shouldn't be anything because uh, I cleared it. And if you uh, would like to clear it with me after you enter your, your Gmail address or email, then click enter, then type in clear, and then you should end up like a page in mind. What you could do is you could press the up arrow and then it would bring you back to your um, Gmail. However, uh, wait, actually I should address you on something. On something. So basically if you type in clear, it won't clear, it will clear out your code visually, but in the programming sense, it's still there actually. So don't be afraid to do slash cl um, clear, C-L-E-A-R, no slash in front. So yeah, type in clear if you want your page to look like mine, so it'd be easier to, for you to follow along. Now, instead of um, our Gmail we want to put in, or email, we want to put in our username for GitHub. So type in git uh, config again, config, and then um, dash dash global, like so, and then user dot name, okay, and then in the quotation marks, put in your um, put in your username. If you don't know what your username is. To the left of your uh, repository name, there should be your username over there. Then just uh, uh, print that out, and no, then not print, uh, type it out in your quotation marks. So mine is Jim the Geek, and then press enter. Okay, once you're done with that, what we want to do next is we want to go to um, basically pushing it into our repository. So right now, our repository name is push GitHub, right? So git commit and then um, dash m, then in quotation marks, put in your uh, your repository name. So mine is push github, so push github like so. And then what we wanna do is click enter on branch master, and then nothing to commit, working tree clean. And that's perfectly fine if it appears like this. You're good to go. And then what we want now is we want to push it. So git push dash u origin, master like so um git push dash u origin master press enter wait a little bit 
and it will like download, collect, blah, blah, blah. Wait until it pops up like this. And then after that, what we want to do is we want to uh, go to our GitHub page, which is right here. Then what we want to do is we want to reload it and it should be there, right? Um, GitHub, hello. Okay, wait, we're gonna go back to our um, my main repository. Then I'm going to, I'm just gonna full screen this. Then I'm going to go to my repository. Let's go to push GitHub. And there we see our folder or your files is gonna pop up inside your repository. Mine's is images. If you click on there, there's all of my images. Um, click on it, you can view it, download it. Yeah, so that is how to push images or folders, files, PDFs, um, Word documents, whatever, etc., into GitHub the easy way. Okay, so that's it for this video. Goodbye. See you in the next one. Bye.